Hey y'all, we are back with more Detroit Become Human. We are back as Connor. It looks like we gotta meet Amanda again. Amanda, 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 Amanda. Where the hell are ya? I feel like it's always safe to go this way first. Oh, she's on the boat. Hey, girly. Oh, I'm so handsome. Hello, Connor. Hello, Amanda. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Even though I'm the one that has to, to fucking row? Why would I enjoy this? What the hell? I'm not your slave, girl. This place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Uh -huh. Far from the noise of the world. Uh -huh. Tell me, what have you discovered? I found two deviants at the Eden Club. Well, we probably shouldn't talk about this. I let them go. I hope to learn something, but they managed to escape. That's too bad. You seem so close to stopping them. Oh, well, maybe she wasn't upset. She didn't like my answer, but like, she didn't seem mad. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. I thought I knew what I had to do. Oh now shit! I realize it's not that simple. Oh shit! My software instability. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. Oh, she knows. Why didn't you shoot? We need the deviants intact for analysis. Shooting them wouldn't have taught us anything. That was a good answer. That was a good answer. Good answer, good answer. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon. I apologize. Y'all know my dogs are nuts. Place you, oh! I know I will succeed. All I need is time. It's not that- oh my god, the thunder just scared me. My headset. Something's happening. I thought there was thunder for Something real inside my house. Serious. I was like, what the fuck? Hurry, Connor. My dog stole Connor's my phone and out. did something with it. Veda, did you steal my phone? There it is. You did steal my phone. What the heck? I apologize. <laughs> Hi, Hank. Oh. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Grace, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was going to be a shitty day. <laughs> so what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building, and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. You checked the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Definitely not what happened. Station employee shot through the back as he was trying to get away. Oh yeah, I did that. One bullet straight through the heart from fifty feet. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. You're right. You're right. It was me. I was Marcus. It was Marcus. I'm what kind of I can examine? Just two employees. You 
already told this. Took the humans hostage. Broadcast okay. their message live. Then made their getaway from the I can investigate this. Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. We found the body of an android on the roof. Not sure what happened. Maybe it got wounded. I mean damaged. Couldn't make a jump. If you want to take a look at the video broadcast by the deviants, it's on that screen. Oop. Oh, I thought it would be behind the desk for Zeus TV. Oh, I stepped over the body so gently. Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. The FBI would take you over the investigation. You should be off the case. No, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. <laughs> Don't fuck up my crime scene. What a fucking prick. For real. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. I think that's RA-9. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Oh, shit. Well, that's awkward. You see something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. What the hell? Why didn't I say he had accomplices? Shit. Nice thing. Thought he's going to taste it again. <laughs> I was like, oh hell no. <sighs> My bullet howls. We left a lot of evidence. A lot of evidence. <laughs> kind of crazy how much we left behind. I 
checks CCTV. They didn't break in. We knew this. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. It's crazy. Whew. I'm tired, y'all. We stored the station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Okay. Um, is there anything else for me to check? Yes, okay. So we'll check this over here. More bullet holes. These are not from an assault rifle. Nope. A handgun. Which would make sense. Given that the deviants were facing that way. talk with them though. Hello. Hello, hello, everybody. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. present when the deviants broke in I do not remember there you go there he is You've been in contact with any other androids recently only station androids in the normal course of my function one of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing which means there's a deviant in this room and I'm going to find out which it is Give yourself up. Maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. It's him. I know it's him. I watched him. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. to be switched off we're gonna search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis you're Damn. going to be destroyed do you hear me destroy i know it's you you keep fucking looking at me while the other ones keep looking forward i know it's you the deviants have just been caught they gave you up there's no point in lying. We know everything. There we go. I knew it. Suck my titties, bitch. Oh. 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 Son of a bitch. Oh 
come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, go get it. Fuck. The stress. Okay, they give me, they give you hella time. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Fuck. They didn't give me hella time with Kara when I fucking got my memory stolen. So I had a little bit of stress coming at me here. We got it though. We got it though. We got it. Jesus, son of a biatch. It's a deviant! Stop! Oh my god, did I just die? Good thing you were here. Otherwise I'd... Connor. Did I just fucking die? It said Hank's probability Connor, of survival no. is 40%. Stop! Oh! <gasps> I better not be dead. I better not be dead. My software instability is question mark, question mark, question mark. Stop. <laughs> Am I fucking dead? Connor, sa do we see that big? Fucking skull. I'm dead? Why did I do that? <gasps> it said Hank's survival was 40%. It didn't say nothing about my own. It didn't say anything about my survival. Fuck my titties. God damn it, Connor. Fuck. I think we're back to. Kara. Maybe, hopefully. Fuck, man. Are you shitting me right now? You guys, that's crazy. Alice's family. Luther's neutral. I'm gonna find help. Haru? Oh, Haru! Hello? <laughs> I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. How do you know she don't want to talk? Please, I really need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Come on. It's better if we talk inside. Oh, okay. Also, whoever he is, he's fucking rude. What a dick. What a dick cat. Little peepee -pee sucker. Douche canoe. All the above. Do you think we can trust him? Uh, probably not. We don't have a choice. Come in. He's not like fucking Zlaco, I don't think. <laughs> What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? 
Maybe it's her son. That's like my best guess. He looks so angry. He's so mad. I don't understand. Teen angst, I guess. <gasps> Damn. Adam, walk faster. We've been out in the cold for fucking several nights. Okay, can we walk up the stairs, please? <laughs> Fuck. Thank you. Aw, Ailis. Take off them shoes, girl. Get you nice and comfy, girl. Oh. <laughs> Alice is unable to undress herself. <sighs> Isn't Alice like fucking 10? She can't undress herself. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, she looks scared. Oh, she looks freezing. Why does she have no pants on? I'm fine, Car. We can't stop because of me. We've got to get across the border. You need rest. Get a good night's sleep and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do oh, humans do sure this? This lady's gonna we help. We didn't do anything wrong. Wait. What? Maybe they're just scared. People are always scared of what they don't know. Why can't we just talk to each other? Or what they don't understand. We're not bad. Maybe one day we will. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. Aww. You'll be back on your feet in no time. Stop, this is so cute. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. Oh my god, well, she's so nice. <laughs> you need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need me. Since we left? She hasn't eaten anything since we left Todd's house? Get some um, sleep. I'm scared? Why Tomorrow, has she not eaten? She should be dead. I'm still- He's so cute. He's so nice. Chickadee dee. <sighs> Let's go talk to Rose real quick. Hello, Rosie. Rosalinda. Rosalinda. Cute pictures. Can't turn on the TV. Hi, my name I'm is Cara. Cara. This is my son, Adam. Ah, her son. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. Kara. Get it right. <laughs> I don't mean to be rude, but get it right. So are you gonna tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Let's be sincere. I trust her. Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden, I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. Stop. So we ran away. I understand. Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Aww. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, Everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. 
We can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. Yeah. No matter what. We have to. Please. You've got to help us. She doesn't, she doesn't have to. Listen. Rose, come quickly. I'm sorry, who is that? Oh, I can stand up. I was not paying attention. What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. Oh. Let me in, 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 let me in. Let me in. We escaped together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? You'll be okay. That's so sad. I wasn't sleepy. Is homegirl just like a fucking... I was gonna say a robot, but that's not funny. It's Could okay. she be? Oh, was I supposed to pick an option? I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention again. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention again. But wait, back to this Alice thing. Could Alice be an android? She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Kara? Kara, and no. Yes. I'm fine. Why are people calling me Kara all of a sudden? Okay, girl, you need clothes on if you're about to walk around this bitch. We can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Shut up, little boy. Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh, no! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be Damn. happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison. Because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam. That's enough. Wow. Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. <sighs> But he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. Wow. Can I, I was gonna say, can I look at stuff? Oh, that's me. Yikes. Awkward. Widespread shock following the android attack on Detroit's Stratford Tower. The machines recorded a video message and broadcast what can only be described as demands on the city's public screens. It's still unclear whether these attacks can be explained by malfunctions or if some organization is behind them. 
So far, CyberLife has refused to comment, but we can expect more information in the following hour. <laughs> talk to Adam. Adam doesn't want to talk to me. That's for damn sure. Let's look out the window. How pretty. We can look at this picture. I think that's Adam's dad. <laughs> How sad. Uh oh. Who'd that be? The police. It's the police. What are we gonna do? They know we're here. We have to open the door. Gonna happen. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine. I knew it. Hurry, Luther. Take Alice and hide in the laundry room. Come on, Alice. Am I what's left? Oh shit. If they see you panicking, it's over. Do you want to get us into trouble? Do you want to get your mother into trouble? And keep calm and just do what I say. Okay. Open now? Oh shit, okay. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? May I come in? Of course. Evening, young man. I'm stressed, I'm stressed, I'm stressed. I forgot one thing about the deviants. There was one left and I don't know what it was. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. Is anyone else in the house? No. No, just us. Do you have any androids here? No, there are no androids here. Shit. I think it Alice is close. Shit.
I'm nervous. What's your name, son? Adam. M my name is Adam. Is Adam's gonna fuck right? this up. Adam? The... The androids, they... He needs a rest. He's been working in the garden all day. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? No. No. I, I, I haven't seen anything. He's gonna fuck this up. I better go. Thanks for the coffee. Have a nice evening. You too. Thank you. Bye bye. You're fucking kidding me. Is somebody else in the house? You're fucking kidding me. It's the dog. He sleeps in the laundry room. Sorry for the convenience. <gasps> Good evening, ma'am. Oh my god, how did that fucking work? Good evening, Adam. How did that work? How did that work? How did that, how did that, how did that work? <sighs> He's gone. It's okay, Alice. We'll be safe now. No, we turn our close. Get yourselves ready. She's gonna take we leave us. Oh. Ooh, that was stress trying to dodge the police and all their damn questions. Oh, there was a couple other options that could have happened. It was he was fooled. Apparently, I missed two things. I don't know. Oh, there's something I missed. All right, y'all. That's all I got for today. That's all I have for this let's play of Detroit Become Human. I hope you really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it, except for the fact that I fucking killed Connor. That fucking sucked. It's like, did I actually kill him? Or will he come back? I guess we'll just have to find out in the next Let's Play. Thank you all so much for all the love and support. It means the world to me. And I will see you all in the next Let's Play. Bye. <laughs>